In this video, I'm going to go over how to add a gradient around the outside of your digital painting. So when it is printed and you have to wrap it around the canvas, the sides of the canvas has have something that relates to the picture and ties everything together. Um, so getting started, make sure that your image is the correct size. So one of the sizes that is back on the website. So go to the website, double check that the um, sizing is correct. Um, if it's not, you're going to want to go up to image, canvas size, and then change the size of your canvas. Um, so right now mine does not fit one of those sizes. So I'm going to make mine a 12 by 8 image. So I'm typing in 12 for the width and then 8 for the height. And then I'm going to hit OK. And this is the size that my image needs to be now. So I'm going to hit Command T and stretch my image to fit the size. And I'm holding down shift while I stretch this so it stays in proportion. You don't want it to be out of proportion. Then I'm going to hit this little check button. And then um, since mine perfectly fit, I don't have to worry about it. But if yours uh, went over the edge on one side a little bit, make sure you crop it. So hit the little crop button. And mine actually did a little bit right here on this side. Um, double check. Make sure delete crop pixels is checked so that it will completely delete and get rid of this edge. And then I'm just going to hit this check button and it crops my image. Um, from there, I'm going to add the outside of my image so that it, I'm able to fill that in and paint it um, to expand uh, to the outside of the canvas. So same thing, go up to image, down to canvas size, and then just add two inches to the width and two inches to the height. So 14 for the width and 10 for the height, and then OK. And that has that border around the outside of the image. So this border, again, is what's going to stretch around the outside of the canvas. Um, I grab the eyedropper tool here. And with the eyedropper tool, I'm going to select an area that I want the primary color of the outside to be. Um, so maybe I'll choose one of these uh, blue shades here. And once you have your uh, color selected, go ahead and add a new layer. Make sure it's below your background layer. And then with the paint bucket tool, just fill in that background. So something like this would work really nicely uh, for the outside of your canvas. If you would like to take it a step further, using the gradient tool could be interesting to add um, an effect to the uh, color that way. So I'm going to double click on my gradient tool here. And at the top, there's some different um, settings to choose from with it. So at the top here, I can grab uh, one of these gradient tools that I want to use, one of the colors, um, and you can change those colors down here. And then just click and drag across your screen where you want that gradient to go. Um, right now, mine's set to radial. I'm going to change that up at the top. And that could just create an interesting um, overall effect for your image. So try that out. Um, see, how that, see how that looks. See what it does for your photo.